আসসালামু আলাইকুম আই এম ডক্টর মোহাম্মদ আতিকুর রহমান অ্যাসিস্ট্যান্ট প্রফেসর অফ ডার্মাটোলজি বসুন্ধরা আদিন মেডিকেল কলেজ এমডি ফ্রম বিএস এমএম টুডেস লেকচার ইজ এসটিআই অর এসটিডি সেক্সুয়ালি ট্রান্সমিটেড ইনফেকশন অর সেক্সুয়ালি ট্রান্সমিটেড ডিজিজ ইউ নো sexually transmitted disease is very much important for dermatology and it is presented by various ways suppose in case of male it is presented by urethras urethral discharge again sexually transmitted disease can be presented with urethral discharge in case of male what may be the cause number 1 is gonorrhea second one is non gonococcal urethritis first one is gonorrhea and second one is non gonococcal urethritis and in ca- in case of male presented with genital ulcer that is herpes genital herpes Chancroid, Chantry or Syphilis and Lymphogenuloma venereum and Ganuloma inguinali. So, I repeat again, the genital, presented with genital ulcer in case of male, genital herpes, Syphilis or Chantry, third one is Chancroid, Lymphogenuloma venereum, Ganuloma inguinali, and Chancroid. So these are the genital ulcer and presented with genital itch, maybe they are rash or not, genital lice or scabies, and candidiasis. and presented with genital lump that is viral wart presented with proctitis especially in male sex with male so these are the presentation of sexually transmitted infection in case of male i repeat the lesson first one is presented with genital presented with urethral discharge that is gonorrhea non gonococcal urethritis and second one is presented with genital ulcer what may be the cause genital herpes syphilis that is primary syphilis chancry third one is lymphogenuloma venereum Ganuloma inguinali and last one is Chancroid and presented with genital itch there may be rash or not what may be the cause genital lice or scabies and candidiasis and presented with genital lump that is viral warts and presented with proctitis especially in case of male sex with male and proceed one in case of female what are the cause of std the presentation is like male in case of female it it is presented with like vaginal discharge one is the cause is candidiasis second one is trichomonas vaginalis and third one is bacterial vaginosis there may be step to or staphylococcal infection also and second one is lower abdominal pain it it may be acute abdominal pain or subacute pain or may be presented with this penuria and third one is genital ulcer 
genital ulcer is same cause genital herpes only one is genital herpes as presented with genital lumps it is same as male in 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 case of female also it is viral ward last one is chronic valval pain there may be each or not it is the causative agent is candidiasis so i repeat the lesson the patient is presented with vaginal discharge what may be the cause the cause is candidiasis trichomonas vaginalis bacterial vaginosis and strepto or staphylococcal infection and second one is lower abdominal pain presented with lower abdominal pain it may be acute or sub acute or dyspnea etc may present and third one is presented with genital ulcer that is genital herpes and fourth one is genital lumps the causative agent is viral ward and last one is chronic valval pain there may be itching or not the etiological agent is candidiasis so we can conclude it that in case of male presented with genital ulcer the most important cause is genital herpes it is painful genital herpes is painful and most important one is shantri that means syphilis it is painless so it, in exam it is frequently asked name the painful genital ulcer in case of male so the answer is genital herpes name the painless genital ulcer it is shantri or primary syphilis so we can conclude it assalamu alaikum